Hello everyone, welcome back to another part of Legend of the Blue Blair, where we play through every single Sonic game in chronological, chronological, sorry, I can't talk today, order of their release. And this time we are going to be doing route number 116, Beyond the Truth of Infinite. Hmm. Oh, are doing a neutral mission this time. Yeah, I'm still picking these out based on random. It's working for me so far. I and mean, the truth of the matter is still, I'm going to have to do these all at some point regardless. So, that doesn't change. Alright, well, I've mentioned it before, but you're basically better off doing a speedrun version of hero mission whenever you're doing neutral. And since I already have all the A ranks for every mission in the game, I don't care what my score is. Uh oh. Rip Damn! Off. Not here! So taking my timing there might have been perfect. Uh oh. Double rut row. Uh, yeah, uh, great strategy there, me. Uh, speedrun, yeah. Um, I don't think I got the homing attack there. Okay. Here. I want my weapon. Okay, I'm not gonna spend too much on. Like I said, uh, I'm on the neutral mission. Just it's always better to do some hero stuff too, so you can get your hero gauge up. Yeah, some control. Alright, must stop. I feel like I should be getting chaos control. I haven't yet, and it's kind of weird. <laughs> Dev intended strats. Oh, that didn't trigger. Okay, I mean, uh, I'm glad. Means I can get through the loop without triggering it. I don't want those two. <laughs> Sneezing is gonna fill up the hero gauge. Yeah, this takes super long, even with chaos control and sticky. Now it's fine. What the? Uh. Okay. Thanks. Nice pop in. But you wanted the emerald. Once I find all of the emeralds, all right. then I'll find the true emerald. Well, we cleared the first stage, which is what story are we on now, like 31, 32, slow 30s, I know that. Mashing my start button, like skip, skip, skip. Don't care anymore. Just skip. It's still mashing start, by the way, just, just in case you had any doubts. Still loading. On today's episode of I'm really glad I'm not playing the PS2 version. Somebody that had the PS2 version when the game launched. Ow. <laughs> Worst slow times for a game I've ever seen. Like, thankfully, it's improved significantly if you play on the emulator versus the actual hardware. The hardware loading was like several minutes. Like, that's like, ah. Uh, just let me say, like, I know your pain. So, I'm actually doing the dark mission here. But again, I have A ranks for every mission, so I don't care what my score is. It's very difficult in my experience to miss the jewels. 
Uh-oh. I didn't think that would trigger. I don't know why that was the logical conclusion for you, but okay. There's that guy right there next. Okay, sure. Yeah, alright. Move in. Like, I just really hope that sliding is what they actually meant you to do. It's like, otherwise, I'm not actually sure what you were intended to do. Like, it's built as if they intended you to quick step, but quick stepping wasn't introduced into the series until Sonic Unleashed in 2008. Like, one more second, second mode, just in case. Uh, too late, they're already here. It looks like a giant bird. There seems to be random lives here and there instead of the, uh, so like, I need to figure out how this gun works exactly. How many of these guys do I have? Okay. Like, I've been attacking so many of them that I might actually trigger the hero mission by accident, but no. As long as I don't attack them, they'll be fine. Mark that one as another. I sincerely hope that's the Devonton method do that through the dark mission, because otherwise you have to not put a bunch of doom soldiers to do what he wants. Unless it specifically has to be Shadow for some reason. I don't know. Makes sense to someone, probably. Skip, 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 skip. Yes, we need to escape the data realm, don't ask. It makes all the sense in the world. Wait, everything we saw so far was just... It was in cyberspace, even though there's dedicated cyberspace levels. Yeah, yep, yep, yeah, yeah. The doctor must have gone this way. I'm sure defenders of the game would try to say, oh, well, he just set chaos controlled onto the... That platform's like, oh, come on, that's clearly not what they were going for. Ah, uh, not possible. Yes, I know. I got rid of it too early. Okay, don't need you for a while. That's not really scientific of you. All that talk about ghosts is just... Come on. Don't care. Actually, no, I can't take this with me. Uh, 
Actually, you know, I almost never use this. Sorry from those few stages. Let's do that. It's like I was gonna be unique. He's the same way. So it's like, I can't. <laughs> you can't you take it with you. Well, on the vehicles. I learned that was back to sky troops. Just keep rushing through. Nice being able to do the neutral mission. Yeah, look at all these oranges. They're spooky. But it gives me dark points. And good dark character. It is so weird hearing Eggman telling you to help the opposing team. Like, I get why there's clearly a programming error going on. It's just really funny to me. Give me this back. Uh, yes. They haven't done the strats all in here. Let's... I think I see that while I go spin bash jumping all over the place. I mean, I have my limits. I please use gas control glitch. I mentioned that before. It feels like it takes away from the a lot of the purpose of doing something like this. To me, it does anyway. It's like, if you're gonna use something like that, then it's like, why are you even bothering? If you're gonna be going through most of the story just on autopilot anyway. I don't think I ever. Oh, no, I did twice, but so I had to force myself to use the gun. That's what I was gonna say. Satellite beam gun. The doctor's gotta be this way. Right? I already mashed my start button. Let me skip. Alright, and on to the Eggman boss. I guess he's upset that we didn't help him with his defenses. This is still probably one of the least logical boss fights to happen. When you really think about it, like, if it's you did the hero mission, then you had nothing to do with Eggman because you were actually trying to avoid attacking him. If you did the dark mission, you helped him with his defenses. He should be grateful to you, if anything. And if you did neutral, then again, you wouldn't care, like, Neutral, he would have the most reason to want to fight you, but still. If anything, it feels like he would have more reason to want to fight you back like Circus Park, which he doesn't, or in Sky Troops, which again, he doesn't. Although I feel like, at least in Sky Troops' this case, it's because if you do the normal mission there, which you're expected to do, I think, for that storyline, then you would have ended up fighting that same boss twice in a row. I do the Iron Jungle version, it's a bit unique. Sort of. It has the unique trait of being substantially easier than the others. Alright, the Doom. We're doing the hero mission. Thankfully. Thankfully, we get the hero mission. I can say thankfully here, so honestly, thankfully, not dark mission. I still have trauma over. Oh. 
you don't have to worry about the A ranks anymore, but still. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. Let's go back. I don't see a civilian. I just see a floating eyeball. You get back here. I was gonna see the counter. Like I need more ammo, but just in case. Down we go. Ow! No, please stop. It's a heal unit that oh, it's for you. This place is this big, and there's only five people working here. It's a goal. I didn't mean to attack you, but it did conveniently end up in the perfect place, so... Wait, we got those two. Uppity, 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 uppity. Ring has been flying. Okay, nice. Don't give up. I didn't think those were going to be big. Castle just an orange deal from in case they were. A few. You already know there's two. You said that you got half of them when we were at five. I was trying to avoid the airstream just to be faster. I don't think Shadow jumped that one. I think that was Maria. She doesn't even have an attack unless she, I guess she comes to punch because she does have that. Oh no, you don't. I am so glad I got to do the hero mission and not have to do the dark one. <laughs> Aren't you still rather do that dark mission than Mad Matrixes? But I feel like next time I do one of these parts, I need to go out of my way for Mad Matrix Dark. I feel like I've put it off for too long. I did it once or twice and I haven't really done it since. Like, really, I'm curious how many times you have to- I feel like it's like 30-something times you have to do any given mission. For stages 4 through 6. Yeah, it's been the same time, like, technically we're trespassing too right now. More so doomed in shadow, but we're all trespassers here. Let's not sound like we're anything else. Ah, uh, needed my weapon. I don't regret it. Ouchie, ouch. Um. 
be fine. There he goes. Sub minute, nice. How dare so, you harm Maria? Get through this. Humans. Out of my sight. Yeah, I know it's an A rank. Because all the A rank requirements are really, really easy in this game, except for like one or two that are strangely stingy. Okay, come on. Well, Shadow, are you an android too? But we're doing the dark mission here, so... No, I'm an android. Goodbye. As a matter of fact, I'm not searching for him. But I also am searching for him. It's very complicated, and I'm not entirely sure I understand it myself. Yes. Find your weapon, right? Just hold on to it and look at it. Yeah, thanks for that, Dirk. You're gonna tell them to lower it. I'm gonna leave that weapon be, even though I do like those guns. I had to fire. Sorry. Sorry, Eggman. Don't get in. That's bad advice. Learn my lesson on that. You're better off just sitting here. So otherwise you have to go back because you wouldn't be able to make that jump because of the light dash fail. It's really weird that Eggman makes that suggestion. Uh oh, bombs are falling. You can use your light dash where those rings are. Yes, yes you can. Before I'll say it again, Gun deserves this for having their priorities completely skewed. There's way bigger problems going on right now, and they're like, you know, let's just fuck Dragman again. But we're, it's, it's what we always do anyway. No, 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 no. It's death. Damn, not here. Thanks for the pep talk. I'm gonna get this one. Just kinda hope I get it before the thing vanished, but okay, sure. Yeah, I can do it a lot more easily when I don't screw up. You gotta fall down on this one. Alright, we're good then. Sub three minutes. Not a particularly amazing time, but a time. I have a use for the doctor. I won't let you humans interfere with my plans. Don't, 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 don't. Yes, it's perfect. Right now we've got to fight Eggman again, but this time he's easier.
backwards. Coming. Ah, oh, he destroyed it. What was my time at? That felt almost perfect. 11 seconds! <laughs> oh. An android? Me? I don't believe you. Okay, second up here on whether or not this is a boss easier to beat or final on the Black Doom. I think I beat that one in 17 seconds, but there's room for improvement. <laughs> There's a little oil room there too, but I don't think there's a lot of it. There's like a second's worth, maybe. And even then, it's kind of random. Because you're not really sure. So I'm just double checking what mission I'm doing here. I'm doing the hero mission, but uh, yeah, it just. There's a little random wiggle room because you don't know for a fact if he's going to end up destroying the turret or not. Even if he doesn't, he probably will. Again later, so you might be better off having him destroy it. Oh. Let's see, let's go with the satellite beam. It's no reason to go up the top path if you're doing the hero mission. Go away, Doom. I love overkill. Hello again. Hey, remember that time I blatantly ignored your request? I did the exact. I mean, I'm gonna say I did the exact opposite, but honestly, I still took out like 45 of the 60 aliens he wanted. So he's probably not actually that upset. <laughs> I thought I hit the button to go on, I guess I didn't. Stay satellites are spooky. So go. Cool. In we go. Knuckles, you're not coming with? Oh, hello. Um, jump dash? I'm not trying to hold me back there. It's a little upsetting to me that we never really got a way to both jump dash and homing attack until Sonic Generations, I think. It might have been colors, but I think it was Generations. And that was mostly just because people complained about it really loudly and back in Unleashed. Another shadow tree. Wow. You say it's a area that has the uh, yeah it is it has the uh, no, ah I almost had it. I mean, it doesn't matter. I have all the keys anyway. But will you? Run here. We can go faster on foot for now. Um, okay. So they didn't cry. Aw, but they look so destructible. Probably I should make that jump if I really try to. I just don't want it. Um, I don't usually stop for this, but since I'm actually using the satellite weapon, like, it's actually kind of worked in this time. It actually works decently well when you're doing the hero mission, anyway. It's the dark mission where it doesn't, because there's so many more targets. Good going. The 
this way. How much did this vehicle deal just... Oh, I didn't notice I was the full gauge. Again, technically faster on foot, the music he has control with some bits, and I think this is one of them. It's probably a good place to activate it. They barely end up being safety break, but... Eh, at least he did that. No, bad, don't lock on. No locking on. Okay. Goodbye. But yeah, you're gonna have to attack one of your friends here, Knuckles. Somehow they locked off the aliens comics technology. The home base. Sure, chaos control here, why not? It's gotta be faster than that. It's gotta be faster than going on the saucer, and it was. Do whatever you need to, Knuckles. I've got my own reasons for being yes. here. Okay. Be the big man and be done with the story. I'm good in time too. 33 minutes on my recording file. Shadow. Very well. If you refuse to obey me, then you'll just have to deal with my finest creation yet. Your finest creation yet has a shadow fever mode that you programmed in. Goodbye, your beautiful rings. Hi, Shadow Fever. Speaking of... Yes, drop them. Drop them right there. Might as well. We don't need any rings. I'm pretty sure the projectile weapon isn't available yet. Who is this? So, no, it isn't. Yeah, well, I screwed up that round. Oh, well, no help in it. You have to let him get his X bomb thing. Okay, I can at least get the job that way. I don't think he's gonna be that surprised. Where is he? There you are. Pass. Should've gone one over. Oh well. At the very least this way he's uh... 
Oh, Shadow Fever again. Wow, now that I have a weapon. Yeah, I was like, he's done. <laughs> he's done. It's nice people do that boss and not die for once. So I swear that happens every single time. Like regardless of the arena. This is the deadliest one, mind you. Like, at least the, the Cosmic Ball one has guardrails. Homie type doesn't do anything crazy in the lava shelter one. Anyway, yeah, that is it for this story. Like I said, it's number 116. Look at the next page. Yep, Beyond the Truth of Invarts. That's the one we just did. Oh, we're almost filled up. Looks like we got one more to fit on the fourth page, and then we can go to page five, and. We're in for a long haul, is what I'm saying. So, see y'all next time we do another story. Even I don't know what it's going to be yet, but see y'all then. Goodbye. Take care, stay safe, and have a good one.